Hello Dragons, my name is Henne Martin and I'm uh, here today to ask for a £100,000 investment. What makes our system different from anything that's out there in the market at the moment is that it can actually predict when people are falling ill. The predictive pattern system does not use any invasive or cumbersome monitoring. Once it is set up and trained, it will not require the user to interact with the system in any way. How many units, what do you think the real size of the market is here? In terms of the size of the market, unplanned hospital admissions cost about £11 billion in the UK in the year. And if we can just prevent a fraction of that, that will be cost savings or potential cost savings to the NHS of hundreds of millions of pounds. This would be a very high risk punt. I personally think it's a risky investment and therefore I am out. What I would be interested in contributing to this business is much more around the new product development of it. I'd be very happy to take you up on your I'm here for a £50,000 investment in my venture to develop a mobile health accreditation board. The core revenue stream for the business is going to be from application makers paying to get their application assessed. So they're essentially betting. How much are they going to pay? I'd be hesitant to say they should charge, we should charge them £2,000 if the reward for them is going to be quite considerable. We can increase mobile health adoption and we can make it, uh, the data that's produced useful to both the patient and the doctor. So we need our £50,000 to conduct our initial assessments and develop our assessment tools to develop our brand and other initial costs for starting the business. Could we start up talking about what problem we're trying to solve here? I'm going to leave this one. Gentlemen, over to you. I would be prepared to invest if, if uh, there is another dragon coming on board. I can help you to make this whole thing work. Even though I'm um, losing a significant portion of the equity, um, I'd still be happy for you to invest. Hello Dragons, I have a product, it's an electromedical device. So my idea came from my own observations while I spent some time in the ICU department of the JR. The device will have an electronic system with a little LCD display. It is a potential gold mine uh, for saving time. In terms of other benefits of this, it will clearly reduce the healthcare load of uh, staff and that can be economically beneficial for the NHS. And then do you have to sell IT, um Unit by unit, hospital by hospital. So primarily I was marketing the intensive care unit because that's where fluid measurement needs to be measured uh, as accurate as possible. It'll be a one-off cost, but the benefits of that will be shown in reducing healthcare time, uh, having more accurate data, improving patient outcomes. So how much money do you think you need to take this to the market? And you have yet to develop a system to measure the density of the individual patient. I like the simplicity of what you're trying to do. I like the way that you're actually bolting a small piece of technology into a system that otherwise works. I will also offer you the full amount for 50% of the business. I'd probably go for Nick, given his um, medical experience. The product I'm going to tell you about is all about democratising healthcare. So it's about access to healthcare across the world. The product is a medical app, so it's an application that you can have on your iPhone or your Blackberry or, or any sort of smartphone. People don't have access to the ability to diagnose this, this condition. The business model for this is twofold. On the one hand, we have a business to consumer model where we'll be giving this app away for free to any consumer who would like to download it. Why, if you've got the only application, would you want to give it away for free? The studies all show that the freemium model increases the number of av the, the average revenue per download. The second area of value is that we can build in a referral system into this application which can then refer people to a doctor. So ladies and gentlemen, I believe that the innovators in, in engineering have spoken and it's time now for the innovators in business to speak, so I open this up to the dragons. My heart rejects the idea of giving anything away for free that I could make money for. I would invest uh, in front of £400,000 but I would be looking for 40% of the equity. Okay, I think I'm happy to take that. Thank you very much. <laughs>